to play Heat by Eminem, or in standard tuning, there's no capo, I'll be teaching you the power chords and the little riff that is played throughout the entire song. We're going to start out with the chords, and then we're going to talk about this riff. Okay, so we have a A5 chord, a D5 chord, and a G5 chord. Those are the three chords that are played throughout the entire song. So if you're A, your index is on the 5th fret of the low E. Ring and pinky are on the A and the D strings of the 7th frets. You can slide that shape all down one string for your D5. So your index is on the 5th fret of the A. Ring, finger, and pinky are on the 7th frets of the D and the G. And finally, for your G chord, you can just slide that A shape down to the 3rd fret. So your index finger is on the 3rd fret of the low E, ring finger is on the 5th fret of the A, pinky is on the 5th fret of the D. And the strumming goes like this in the chord progression. So we start on our A chord, down, 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 down to our D5 chord. G5 chord down 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 back to the A. I'm gonna start speeding up here. And then at full speed it sounds like this. So the chord progression is pretty simple, the strumming pattern is all downstrokes. Um, you can just listen to the song and play along with it, you'll get the rhythm there pretty easily. What I'd like to talk about now is this riff. It's a lot of hammer-ons. So what we're going to do is we're going to play our open E, hammer-on to the 3rd fret of the low E with our index finger, then hammer-on right afterwards with your ring finger to the 5th fret of the low E. slide that index finger down to the third fret of the A. You can just hammer onto it, you don't have to actually pluck it. Or you can pluck it. I just hammer onto it. Then you're going to play it open and hammer on again. And then open, and then you're going to go up to the fifth fret with your index finger. That way you can transition back into your A5 chord for the strumming. Otherwise, you can just use your ring finger. So, going nice and slow here, hammer on, hammer on, pull off, hammer on, open, and you're on your fifth fret of the low E. Then you can continue plucking when you're on this fifth fret. A note of the low E string. One more time here. And at full speed. And that's it. So that's going to be it for this tutorial. If you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.